Leroy, what's training camp been like here for you? New team, new environment, just trying to get acclimated to everything going on here. Uh, it's been good. Uh, I've been able to just learn everything, learn the defense, um, and getting into special teams. Um, just trying to fit in, you know, find my role, and, you know, do it to the best of my ability. When you joined the team in the offseason, did they kind of outline what they expected from you, kind of, you know, gave you a plan of what they expected? Oh, well, when I initially got here, I was uh, still rehabbing. I had surgery in January, so I think the plan for me, you know, right away was just get healthy mm -hmm. um, and, and do everything in my power to, to be ready for training camp. And, and I feel like I have did that. Um, I think I'm six months removed from surgery, so and I feel pretty good. So I think it's a good start. What did you have surgery on? Uh, I tore my pec last August, so I had surgery in January. Okay. Do you feel like you have full strength back? I mean, obviously, that's one of the biggest challenges coming back from that injury. No, definitely, definitely. Uh, I think we did a great job rehabbing this summer, um, I feel got a lot stronger, uh, and, and I feel good. My body feels good. I'm working my way back, you know, to full, but uh, it's a day-to-day -day process. You have starring experience as well as special teams experience from your time in Atlanta. Do you envision the chance to be able to challenge for a starting role, especially with that weak side spot open? Uh, I mean, I think that's just, you know, the goal every day is to compete and get better and, and kind of get after it. So for me, I, I think I just can do my part as, as a competitor, uh, put my best foot forward, and you know. Um, that, that's the goal, though, definitely to get out there and, and play with you know, a great group of guys and, and, and commit to, to something that's bigger than myself. So what is it like coming into this locker room after being the one in the land the last couple of years? You know, had a chance so close to win the Super Bowl, obviously, two years ago, and then losing to Philadelphia last season. Uh, well, you know, you know, I got a lot of friends here. Um, I played with Rodney in college, uh, you know, familiar with Chris Long uh, going to UVA as well, so guys I look up to. Um, just other guys, you know, I played with Alshon in Chicago, so... Um, it's just something that was familiar to me. Um, I was able to come in, kind of the guys, the linebacker group, great group of guys that you know welcomed me in. Uh, luckily, Paul Willow was here as well when I got here, so you know it was easy getting acclimated and transitioning. So I was able to learn everything and and kind of just you know make this a home. So uh, I'm grateful to be here. Of course, yeah. Is there any weird feelings of uh, when Philadelphia first reached out and you're like, that's a team that kept us from winning the championship and all that? No, no, not at all. I mean, I think uh, just from the off season. Philly was the most consistent with, uh, you know, reaching out to my agent, reaching out to myself. And, uh, and I think they, you know, they wanted me and I wanted to be here. I mean, even last year, you know, when I went back to Atlanta, um, you know, I had an opportunity to come to Philly. So, you know, um, coming into this year and them still wanting to reach out and want me here was, you know, very, you know, something promising that I look for. So I was, uh, I was glad to be here. You made a big play in that playoff game last year, so we probably could have used it maybe a little sooner than yeah, that, though. Yeah, nah, definitely, definitely. Uh, big play on special teams. Um, so yeah, that's why I found my niche, man. So I, I try to uh, give uh, effort, guy, give all I can. So. so you went through the aspect of trying to come back after losing the Super Bowl last year with Atlanta. Here, it seems trying to rebound after winning, you know, to get back to that level again. What are some of the challenges, and what do you sense from the environment from what you've been able to gather to this point? Uh, I, I think, you know, just being in Atlanta um, is definitely one of those things that you always got to, like, get after it every day. Um, the mindset was just a little different, um, you know, losing one and then here's winning Certainly. one. But, but I think it's uh, definitely the mindset we're going after. Last year's last year, um, just like the previous year before that. So each year is a new year. Um, each team has the opportunity at it. So I think for the group of guys in here, just knowing, you know, the opportunity that's at stake and, and that all these guys know it. Uh, like, you know, they put an emphasis on it. So I, I think that's the goal, and that's always going to be the goal.